on the floor first. So if you're do going down to the floor, everybody on the floor, hands and knees. If you're using your chair as the floor, you're going to be like this. So we're all going to be in tabletop, okay? What is tabletop? That's when your back is parallel to the floor and you're flat like a table, okay? So you're either here and I'm using the seat as my, as my floor or I'm down on my hands and knees, okay? Get where you need to be. We're going to do trunk rotation, okay? So what we're going to do, watch here. Hands are under your shoulders, tummy is in. You're going to lift your left arm up. As you lift your left arm up, you're going to turn and look at that left hand. So you're trying to turn your chest to the left. You're going to look at it, and then you're going to take that arm, and you're going to slide it under your other arm so you're facing the right wall. If you can get your shoulder or your head down to the floor, fine. If you can't, put a pillow there, okay? You're going to take a deep breath in, take that left arm all the way up towards the ceiling, look at it, chest to the left, big exhale, slide it under your right, and look to the right. So you should feel that your trunk rotating, okay? So we're going to do that same thing on that side. So do it with me. So left arm is going to reach up, look at it, you're turning your chest to the left, Big exhale, slide it under the right, look to the right. Do it again. Inhale, left arm up, chest to the left, look at your hand. Exhale, slide it under the right, look to the right, okay? Inhale, left arm up, chest to the left. Exhale, slide it underneath, look to the right. Inhale, left arm up, Chest to the left, exhale, slide it under. Good, one more time on this side. Inhale, left arm up, look at it. Big exhale, slide it underneath, look to the right. Good, come back to that tabletop position, hands and knees, okay? Now we're gonna lift our right arm up. So tummy is tight, deep breath in, lift your, ref, you lift your right arm up, Turn your chest to the right. So you're kind of looking up at that right hand. Big exhale, slide it under your left. Looking to the left, okay? We're gonna do it again. Inhale, right arm up, chest to the right. Exhale, slide it under, look to the left. Do it again, inhale, right arm up, chest to the right, exhale, rotate, slide it under, look to the left. Good, very nice, inhale, lift up, look to the right, chest to the right, exhale, slide it under, look to the left. One more time, deep breath in, bring that arm all the way up, big exhale, slide it underneath. Good, come back to hands and knees. I want you to just do a few racks from your hands and knees, front to back. So weight towards your hands, weight towards your feet, okay? Pressing your hips back. If you're on the chair, same exact thing, okay? So if you're on the chair, you're shifting forward, you're dropping back, okay? Just give your back a little bit of a stretch. Dropping back. Don't forget to breathe, my friends. Let your head relax. Okay, breathe in, big exhale, drop back. Good, do it about two more times. And then when you're ready, you're gonna take your time, slowly and safely, you're gonna come all the way up to standing. Grab some water and keep moving. Grab some water and keep moving. So that was, that was like a little hiatus there, huh? It was an easier one. You're welcome, yep. All right, so next up, we are going back to high intensity. Jab, cross, duck, hook. Jab, cross, duck, hook. Jab, cross, duck, hook, remember? We're gonna start with our left foot forward, our right foot back, okay? You're hearing me a lot today say power stance. I wanna see your feet wide, at least two feet apart, okay? Turn that front toe forward a little bit. That's gonna give you even more stability. I want you to sit into your legs, so just rock your weight back and forth, front to back, okay? 
If your feet are like this, you're not going to be as stable. So take it wide, really wide. Bend your legs, get your hands up, okay? Left leg is forward. You're going to go left, right, squat low, big duck with that right arm, okay? Here we go. One, two, duck, hook. Here we go. One, two, get low, big hook. One, two, duck, hook. Speed it up. One, two, duck, hook. It's okay if you have to say it to yourself, okay? How do you think I do it? One, two, I gotta talk. Good, let's go. One, two, duck, hook. Let's go. One, two, duck, hook. Keep your hands up. One, two, get low, get up. One, two, low, up. One, two, low, up. Let's go. One, two, duck, hook. Come on. One, two, duck, hook. One more time. One, two, duck, hook. Stick and move. What does that mean? Shift your weight. Shift your weight. Shift your weight. Switch sides. Switch sides. Right foot forward. You're shifting your weight front to back. Here we go. One, two, duck. Hook. One, two, duck, hook. Let's go. One, two, duck, hook. Make it big. One, two, keep your hands up. Let's go. One, two, duck, hook. Come on. One, two, duck, hook. Let's go. One, two, duck, hook. One, two, duck, hook. One, two, get low, get up. One, two, duck, Hook, stand tall. One, two, low, up. One, two, low, big hook. One, two, make it bigger. Low, up. One, two, duck, hook. One more. One, two, duck, hook. Stick and move. Woo! All right, awesome job, you guys. Woo hoo! Keep moving. Keep moving. All right, we're gonna work a backwards step today, okay? We are gonna work a backwards step today. Lots of times, we lose our balance in the backwards direction, okay? So, we talked about the power stance, right? So if you hinge, doing a lot of hinging today, right? Remember we did our deadlift? We did a lot of power stance for our boxing. So if you come into your power stance, when you're going backwards, you're gonna have a little bit more stability, okay? So we're gonna do, a, we're gonna practice that, bringing our arms forward, okay? So it's gonna look like this. We're gonna step back, hinge, push forward. Big stump, big posture. I want you to stand up as tall as you can, okay? Press back, so step back, push forward. So look at what's happening. So if I don't hinge, where am I gonna go? On my butt, right? You can use a chair if you want. Step back forward, okay? Try the other side. Step back, hinge, like push forward, bend, 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 big stomp. Good, do it again, press back, push forward. Good, big stomp. Okay, we're gonna do call outs. So that means I'm gonna say right or left, you're gonna step right or left. If you think you need a chair for balance, it's right next to you, okay? Show me your big posture, roll those shoulders back, stand nice and tall, ready? Three, two, one, right. Step back, hinge, big stomp, right. Step back, hinge, big stomp, right. We're going right, right side only right now. Good, big stomp. So you're gonna do a big step, come right back to center, big stomp. Big step, big stomp, good. Big step, big stomp, right. Big step, big stomp, right again. Good, listen up, left. You're gonna step left, here we go. Step left, big stomp, big stand. Step left, push away, stomp it. Big step, push away, stomp. Big step, hinge, left, good, left, good, right, right, left, right, big stand, left. Get ready, left, gotta listen, left again, right, right, left, right, left, right, left, good, big hip hinge, left, Right, big hip hinge, left, 
job, you guys. That's a tricky one. Woo! Keep moving. High intensity. Going back. All right. It just so happens that we have time to do our high intensity interval with our color challenge. Okay. Bonus points. Big shout out if you can remember and you can show me what the colors are. Okay. You remember? This is from several minutes ago. What's red? Who can show me red? What's red? Remember what red is? Jump squats. Okay. Nice job. Okay. What's green? What's green? Show me green. What's green? Yes. Jumping jacks. What's blue? I'll give you a hint. Your favorite. Hopscotch. Blue. Out in. Out in. Okay. Here we go. Red. Red. Do it with me. Big arm swing. Get up. Get up. Blue, blue, remember blue? Hopscotch, out, in, out, in, double, single, double, single, double, single, green, green, jumping jacks. Okay, now I'm not telling you anymore. You can do it. Red, what's red? Show me, red. What's red? Yes. Good. Green. What's green? What's green? Come on. Stay with it, you guys. You got it. Red. Red. What's red? Yes. Woo. Blue. What's blue? Hopscotch, your favorite. Yes. Green, green, what's green? Keep with it, stay with it you guys, I know it's hard, stay with it. Red, woo, come on, red, finish it up, you're almost there. Woo, good, walk or jog it out. Nice job you guys, keep moving. Oh, we're so close. All right, we're so close, you guys. We got one more exercise, okay? We are going to work the penguin turn, okay? We are gonna work the penguin turn. So, real quick, keep moving around, okay? I want you to turn 180 degrees, and I want you to count how many steps it takes you, okay? So if you're facing me, you're gonna turn to the back, and you're gonna count how many steps it takes you, okay? So if I'm facing you, one, two, three. Or if I take smaller steps, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? That's your little self quiz. You got your number? Once you have your number, hold it up. How many steps did you take? There's no judgment, I'm just, I just wanna know when you're done. Okay, so you got how many steps you took, right? We're gonna alternate 180 degree turns, okay? Your goal is to do it in less than the one that you just did, okay? So if it took you four steps, try to do it in three. If it took you six, try to do it in five. So you're gonna face backwards. We're gonna practice both ways. So you'll go to the right, and then you'll go to the left, okay? Then you'll go this way, and come back this way. It's okay to pause if you're getting a little bit dizzy. Have a chair nearby. So the key is we're going to take our feet nice and wide. Shift your weight side to side, okay? You're going to try to do a penguin turn. What do penguins do when they turn? They kind of waddle, okay? So that's what we're going to do. All right, so here we go. We're going to work that turn. Big turn to one direction. You can shift and sway as you face backwards, and you're going to come back, face me, okay? A little break in between is gonna be just shifting your weight from side to side, okay? Then go the other way. Few of steps as you can. Come back the opposite direction. Good, if you need a break, you're just shifting side to side. Go the other way. So you're always alternating sides, okay? If you need a break, just shift your weight from side to side. Turn and face me. Okay, now go the other way. Shift and sway, turn. 
Good, big base of support. What's gonna make you successful is a weight shift, okay? A weight shift, turns gonna be hard, okay? If you shift your weight side to side, it makes it a lot easier because you're freeing up one leg. That's the leg that can move, okay? Almost there, a couple more times. If you're getting dizzy, you're gonna hold this side to side shift. Do you feel this in your outer hips a little bit, okay? That's the other way you know you're doing it right. Feel it in the outer hips, okay? A couple more times, big turn, few up steps as possible, okay? And then once you're ready, I want you to do one more and see how many steps it takes you, okay? So do the same way that you did the first time. Come on back, and then hold, when you're done, hold it up. How many, how many steps did it take you? How many steps, okay? It's okay if it's the same. It's okay if you're a little less, whatever, okay? So just know that there's some improvement there. That's a good strategy for turning. All right, we're gonna walk it forwards and backwards. You guys are rocking it out today. Thank you, we're gonna start cooling. We're gonna continue cooling it down. Nice, easy walk, nice, easy arm swing. So if you're not sure, the thing that's nice about this video, unless you have your camera off, is you can see what you're doing, right? So if you can't see your arm swing, with how you are on the screen, make it bigger, okay? And make sure your arms are evenly swinging. So just walking it forwards to backwards, nice and easy. Good, couple more times. This is the cool down, so we want big posture, but we're bringing that intensity down a little bit. Good. Last time, walk it forward. And walk it backwards. Good. Take your feet together, almost together. We're going to step out to the left, turn our toe out, come back to center, go the other way. Step right, center, big step, big turn, push off that leg, come back. Step, push, stomp. Step, push, stomp. Good. I want to see your palms up to the ceiling. I want to see your fingers spread nice and wide. I want to see your elbows straight. So you're really activating your arms. Yes. Nice and big. You're trying to get those arms as big as possible. Palms up. Elbows straight. Big step. Big stomp. Good. We're focusing on movement quality. Good. Four more. You got it. Nice. Beautiful. Three. Good. Two, nice job. Keep those feet nice and wide. Keep them nice and wide. Good, we're gonna shift left, right. We're gonna slow it down, left, right. Reach through both hands, reach through both hands. Good, left, good. Now we're gonna pause, we're gonna go across the body. Okay, so you're gonna take your left hand, you're gonna reach up into the right, and then with your right hand, up and to the left, okay? So cross your body, stretch up as tall as you can. Pause there for a second, okay? You should feel a stretch through your torso. Good, reach up, reach up, nice and big. Think about really reaching from your toe up to your fingertips. Big reach and stretch, big reach and stretch. Good, big reach and stretch, big reach and stretch, good. This time I want you to bring your arms all the way out, take a nice deep breath in, open them up as wide as you can. Good, you're gonna take that left arm, you're gonna move it big and fast over to your other hand to twist, one, two, three, twist. Once your hands are together, turn them. See if you can look behind you a little bit more. So you're turning your trunk, pivot on that foot. Good, come back, deep breath in, open up. So remember when we turn, we're gonna look. We're gonna do that same side again. So left hand, ready? We're gonna look where we're turning. Three, two, one, big and fast. Good, now look and turn. See if you can point your hands to the back. Oh yeah, good, deep breath in. Come all the way back. Right hand, where's your right hand? Stand up tall, good. Big and fast, across your body. Three, two, one. See if you can slap your hands together. Look at them, good. Can you turn those hands to the back? Take your hands backwards. Good, working that trunk rotation. Deep breath in, come all the way back towards me. One more time. Right arm, big and fast, clap them. Good, now if you're looking at me, 
it's harder to turn. So look at your hands and then see if you can take your hands and your eyes to the back. Yep. Nice deep breath in. Come all the way up. Good. Exhale. Reach for the floor. Bend forward. Deep breath in. Come all the way up. Low T. Chest is up. Chin is up. Arms are low. Fingers wide. Good. Big exhale. Reach for the floor. Big inhale. Stand tall. Open up that chest. Lift your chin. Good. One more time. Deep breath out. Reach for the floor. Deep breath in. Come all the way up. Arms are low. Press those hands back. Lift your chin. Pull the shoulder blades together. Woo! Good. Deep breath in. Both arms reach all the way up. Big exhale. Pull your elbows towards your sides like you're stretching out right through your chest and shoulders. You're digging those elbows right into your sides. Good. Deep breath in. Reach high. Big exhale. Open up that chest. Elbows to the sides. One more time. Deep breath in. Reach high. Big exhale. Open up that chest. Good. Release those arms down. Take a nice deep breath in. Come all the way up. Let your left arm down, but reach your right arm up and over. So holding stretch now. So did some dynamic stretch where we're kind of moving and lengthening. Now we're holding and lengthening. So a couple deep breaths right here. So you're feeling this side of your trunk. Good. Nice deep breath in. Come all the way up. Big hands. Exhale the right arm down. Reach the left arm up and over. And then don't forget to breathe. So sometimes when we're holding, we hold our breath. So we want to feel that stretch right through here. Awesome job today, you guys. Good, you're almost there. Nice deep breath in. Come all the way up. Big exhale. Release your arms down. Grab your chair. Okay, sit right towards the edge of the chair. We're going to do one more stretch for the low back. So if you're flexible through your low back, you can let your back round and reach for the floor. If you're not as flexible, you're going to let your head hang and your arms come to your thighs. You should feel a release across your low back. Take a couple nice deep breaths. So I want you to inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. So you're allowing your spine to round here. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. You're going to take both of your arms over towards your right leg. You can reach for the ankle or you can just let your arms rest on your thigh. That's going to feel like more of a stretch on the side of your back. Don't forget to breathe. Good. Come back over. Move to your left thigh or reach down for your left ankle. So we're still bending forward, but we're adding a little bit of a side stretch to really target that low back. 